So hey guys, what's up? This is Easy, and today I'll be showing you guys a tutorial on how to go through walls. So as you can see right here, right in front of me, this is like a castle-like stru- Whoa, what the? <laughs> I just kind of got sick myself. Okay, so right in front of me, there is this uh, castle-like structure, and the only problem is that there is no actual um, entrance to get inside. So if you walk around, well, if I walk around at least, you can see that there's no actual way to get inside without breaking the blocks. But if I can show you right now, there is indeed a way to get inside. All you gotta do is just go through this wall, this hole right here, and bada bing bada boom, I got inside, uh, safe and sound, with my minecart. So as you can see, I've actually used two stone, uh, cobblestone stairs right there, and using that, uh, I just got inside with the minecart, and then I just got inside, so there you go. Uh, I just went through the walls, and now I'm going to teach you guys how exactly I did that. So the reason is that this is actually, I'm actually on survival mode, if you cannot tell already. Um, I'm clearly on survival mode. You can see my armor, my health right there. And I want to show you guys this in survival mode because I know for a fact there's going to be some of you guys who are going to doubt me and they're gonna, you're going to probably say that I'm lying. But clearly I just went through the, like I'm going to do it, I'm going to show you guys a second time just in case. So what I did is that I just went through this wall right here and I got inside the minecart without any uh, problems. And then I just got on this ladder and now I'm on top of the building that uh, apparently I didn't get on. Uh, there's like no entrance that you saw. So now I'm going to show, show you guys how I can actually do this. So now I'm going to switch into creative mode and I'm going to teach you guys exactly how to do this. So I've already uh, made some uh, things right here just in case I forgot. But this is the basic adjust of what you want to do. So first of all, you're going to want to have the block of your choice. Now the only blocks that you I recommend using are either wood or cobblestone or uh, stone bricks. I recommend wood because wood's pretty simple. The second item that you're going to want to use is the wooden stairs right here. Well, oak stairs, whatever you want to call it. The next one you want to have is your rails, your minecart, and last but not least, you're going to want to have just some torches, just uh, just uh, just for the lighting. So first of all, you want to build a. Uh, uh, wooden blocks three in a row like so and then either on the right side or the the right end or the left end Just put another block on top So you should make this L shape kind of thing now What you want to do is that on the other side you want to put the stone stair facing this way Make sure it's facing this way and then right next to it You want to make the stone the the wooden stair face like this face it like this So now you have this little box right here as you can see there's actually when you point your pointer do it the, bl the whole block lights up, but the, when you point it this way, there's actually like a space right there. That's good. That's what you want. So after doing that, you want to encase the um, thing in another L shape. So four blocks on the top and two blocks on the side. Well, three blocks on the side, really. And then you have this wall right here. Now, what you're going to want to do is right on this particular on this particular stair, you want to make sure that there's a space in between and put a wooden block right there. Now, what you're going to want to do is actually put a rail like this. Now, sometimes the rail can face the wrong way. So if that's the case, then you want to put three rails like this. And doing this trick will actually always make sure that the rail is facing this way. So once you put the rail onto the block, you want to put your minecart. And then in case the mine, this is the most important step, in case your minecart in blocks like this. So now once you've done that, uh, you want to go this wall. Now, here's the most important thing. Uh, when you're trying to find the hole into the wall, you're going to notice it right away. So first of all, you kind of just scan it like this, and then you're going to see that you're going to notice there's like a space right about here. So what you want to do is just hold it, get kind of close to the wall, hold it, and then you get into the minecart, and you're able to go through the wall without any problems. So that's kind of basically how you do it. Now, if you're confused on what I just did, um, because I know some people will ask this, uh, when you're doing the three, when you're doing the th blocks like this, three wide, and then you put one on the end, make sure the stairs like this, and you want your person to like this. So you make sure it's facing this way. You want your person to look sideways like this, and then that's when you place the stair so that it makes this kind of shape. What you don't want, you do not want it to be like this. Okay, uh, if I can just do it. Don't if you if it's like this, then you're doing it wrong. Okay, so make sure that it's not like that. You want to have it that it's so that it's facing like this, okay? Um, if it's not like this, then you're definitely doing something wrong. So make sure that it's like this, that's like that before you do, you go on to the minecart step. Make sure the minecart is also one block away from the door and that it's actually facing the stone, uh, the, the stair that's uh, oriented like that. 
and also make sure that the sta the minecart's blocked off so that you can't actually move the minecart by accident. Okay, so that's basically how you get through walls. So again, if I just demonstrate, let's find that hole in the wall. It's right about here, if I can point it. Yeah, right there. Just, uh, if I can get close enough, let's see. Did I, oh wait, uh, oops, <laughs> I accidentally broke it. So yeah, I have to go back into first person just to show you guys. So let's just put that back and okay, that's not really right, but um, yes, yeah, the basic idea. So you just do that, hold it, and you get in the minecart. So that's basically the simple tutorial on how to go through walls. Now, um, be careful though, because you can only do this trick with the following walls. Now, if you're playing on single player, it doesn't really matter what blocks you use, but if you're playing on multiplayer and you plan on using this trick to get into secret, uh, secret locations, then these are the blocks that you must only use to make sure that you're really camouflaged. So, you want to use stone stairs with the cobblestone. You want to use the stone bricks with the stone brick stairs. You want to use the regular wood, uh, oak planks, I mean, with the oak stairs. So, the basic idea is that when you're, if you're going to do this on multiplayer, make sure whatever stair and block you have, they actually match each other. Just so that it looks less suspicious, because, like, like this, for example then it doesn't really look like any, like anything suspicious is going on, right? So make sure, just uh, keep that in mind. But yeah, that's the basic idea on how to teleport through walls, and this is only, this is working as of 0.8.1, I mean. And yeah, so just go try it out for yourself. Um, all, if you're confused, just keep, just rewatch the video, and just look carefully at how I actually built the blocks and such. So yeah, that's going to be it for this video for the tutorial on how to go through walls. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Leave a like if you liked the video. Also leave any comments for any other glitches or tricks that you want me to try out or figure out on my own. And yeah, that's going to be it for this video. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. So peace out and later.